EMOS is a European research project co-funded by the European Commission involving 11 partners from industry and academia belonging to six European countries. Among them, we find some of the major players in the cloud computing field. EMOS's main objective is to enable real-time interaction and collaboration between people using distributed multimedia applications running on top of a cloud infrastructure with guaranteed levels of service. For this, a number of problems and challenges in the distributed cloud computing areas must be overcome. What is the picture today in distributed computing? The advancements have driven the emergence of service-based infrastructures that allow for on-demand provision of ICT assets. Take though into consideration the complexity introduced in such environments. A number of challenges arise at various levels of the infrastructure, and not only during the process of providing and managing the offered level of quality, but also given the need to facilitate real-time interactivity. And this is the main objective of the EMOS project. But which are the problems and challenges in the cloud computing field, and how EMOS aims to address them? As known, current cloud solutions do not provide supporting tools to make the development and deployment of applications easy. EMOS provides a set of tools, namely service engineering, along with a methodology on how to engineer applications for cloud-based platforms. In addition, current cloud solutions do not come with tools to predict applications' behavior. Aramis provides a service modeling environment and tools to model service-oriented applications and predict their behavior when executed on clouds. As well, current cloud solutions request from the end users to provide low-level details regarding the resource requirements. Aramis provides performance estimation services that allow end users to deal with high-level application parameters since these services undertake the task of defining the low-level resource attributes and workload characteristics of the applications. Furthermore, current cloud solutions do not provide appropriate supporting tools for the management of applications at runtime. Aramis provides service management tools that support automated resource negotiation and renegotiation resource reservation, application execution and monitoring, while addressing real-time performance requirements conforming to fine-grained service level agreements. Moreover, current cloud solutions do not virtualize all kinds of resources. Aramis incorporates a Sony and intelligent service-oriented network infrastructure that provides virtual service networks by virtualizing, besides computing, also networking and storage resources. Lastly, current cloud solutions do not guarantee the quality of the provided services. Aramis enables real-time attributes at all levels of the environment, from application to platform, down to infrastructure. Although your most results are independent from applications, these results will be validated through three different scenarios. Digital film post-production, virtual and documented reality, interactive real-time learning. If I compare the requirements for post-production today with requirements of post-production 10 years ago, I have to admit that the requirements are increased very, very much. 10 years ago, there was plenty of time between release of the uh, film uh, to the DVD or to the uh, production in television. Today, it's all very, very close. The same time a movie is shown in cinema, it has to be available for digital cinema, it has to be ready for internet, it has to be ready in 2D, in 3D, it has to be very, very soon ready in all different languages. So the pressure for post-production is really, really high. That means that you have to spend a lot of dedicated hardware at different places around the world to get all this stuff ready. You have it ready for all these different features. Over the last years, engineering companies are aiming to reduce the product development time, which leads to an increased interest in collaborative virtual and augmented reality. Our visualization and simulation environment, CoVise, offers tools and means to establish such working environments. Elmos enables our software to provide this task in a high per, uh, quality and performing way, ensuring quality of service across several networks and guaranteeing the computational resources which are required 
to stream augmented reality videos between several participants is a key feature to improve the visual quality while keeping up the interactivity of the collaborative session. Service level agreements allow even persons with a non-technical background to specify the requirements in a high level way they can understand. We are developing e-learning applications. I belong to the research center of Junti Labs in Italy and we are working on our platform uh, LearnExact for e-learning applications. Some of our application has real-time constraints. For example, mobile e-learning in which uh, several users uh, receive uh, contents from uh, a server into their mobile phones while moving in the city. Other applications are in the virtual world field in which several users are meeting as avatars into a virtual world. We deployed our application on traditional server but we were not satisfied of performances. So we installed our application on Irmos and we was astonished about the fact that uh, Irmos just uh, uh, required little effort for adding some wrappers to our application, for monitoring and configuring our application, and for adapting the application to the Irmos platform. In this way, we can guarantee the quality of service of our applications. The IRMAS approach and technical solutions constitute a new generation of service-oriented cloud computing environment. The IRMAS cloud solution is provided as four major bundles. One, a set of application development tools including a specific methodology for the creation and adaption of interactive applications for virtualized, real-time service infrastructures. Two, the service engineering tools which support the application modeling and performance estimation. Three, the service management tools supporting the deployment and management of applications at runtime. Four, the intelligent service oriented network infrastructure solution known as ASONI, offering virtualized computing, networking, and storage capabilities. What has happened over the last few years? Different concepts like platform as a service or infrastructure as a service have evolved to something what is today a successful story the cloud services. But current cloud solutions have a major limitation. They don't consider specific requirements of real-time interactive applications. We are working in Irmos to develop an innovative platform that will allow people to interact and collaborate in real-time over distributed multimedia application running on top of a cloud infrastructure. The support of interactive real-time application is a key requirement for the telecommunication industry, and it seems like a, a strong driver for the adoption of the cloud technologies by the uh, telco marketplace, which is uh, of major interest for Alcatel, Lucent, and Telefonica. All IRMIS partners, both industrial and academic, have a great interest on the adoption of the project results, which are of major relevance within the current cloud computing landscape. 